Hello and welcome in. My name is Tri Rogue, and I am back with another tutorial concerning Live 2D because let's face it, it is a complicated program and a lot of things can go wrong when you are trying to rig your own model. This is a mistake I have made several times um, when I was first learning how to rig and is um, a mistake I have seen a lot of fellow riggers do um, and a lot of qu this question the same question keeps popping up so I decided it'd be easiest to just make a quick little tutorial video on how to fix it surprisingly it's a lot easier than you would think to fix it um, if you have the free version of life 2d it will be a little more difficult and you might have to sacrifice a few uh, quality things However, it can still work for you. Okay, so this is kind of like an extreme example of oops, what it could look like. Um, but I just wanted to be able to like make sure it could clearly show some of the issues people are running into. So as you can see here, sometimes the um, layers kind of overlap. Like I got part of the um, shirt here. Don't know what this is. And then you can see, like, especially in the face here, that a lot of the layers are actually red right now and the opacity is turned down. These are some telltale signs that there is something wrong with um, your texture atlas. So if we go in here, you can look here and you can see that these are overlapping. So it was the waist, uh, one of the boobs, the wings are fine. And then you look over to this side, you see all these layers that are not included. That's what's creating um, the, um, the awkward red. So how do you fix it? So the issue here, it can be complicated when you only have the free version because you only get the one page at 20 by 48. So what you could do is, sorry, uh, go in, click on the top one, scroll all the way to the bottom, ignore paper because that's not what you need. You hold shift and then you click that bottom one and you click um, right click and then you click place selected objects into texture atlas. So you got these all here and that's not going to help because those are overlapping again. Like that's, this is what that's going to look like. It's going to look horrifying. Yep. I was correct. It looks horrifying. <laughs> so how do we fix it? I'm going to go into automatic layout and you're going to want some margin. So I usually do 30 pixels, but that's because I have the pro version. Um, you can drop it as long as it's not going to um, overlap. And if you look in here, oop, cancel. Nothing is overlapping. Everything is in. And that's really what we needed. However, if you look here, the percent, the scale percent is 68.7 and you for the best um quality visually you're going to want 100 percent but like i said that's not always going to be possible if you have the free version so i go back in here click ok and look nothing is red nothing is overlapping and we're good to go now if you have the pro version you can go back in here, automatic layout. I would go back up to 30 per pixels. Boom. As you can see, it ain't having everything. Oops. So what you can do is go up here into add texture. Um, and you can set it to whatever size you want. It doesn't really matter. I'm just using 2048 by 2048 um, for the purposes of this tutorial. Uh, 
Go on the top one, scroll all the way down again. Boom, bam, turkey ham. Go back into automatic layout. And I always allow um, rotations because it really doesn't affect it. And it doesn't really matter how many you have. Like I've never really had an issue. And obviously some of these can be um, moved around and fitted. Like some of these smaller ones definitely could have fit in this one or in this one. Um, but that's if you wanted to do the more of the finagling yourself. This was just easier and quicker for me personally. Click OK. As you can see, we are good to go. And when you have them all at 100% rather than um, that 68%, um, it's going to be a higher, higher quality picture because you're not kind of like zooming. And that's it. That's how you fix the problem. Like I said, it's really quick and easy. Um, and of course, if you have any questions on how to fix it or if there, this doesn't fix your problem, feel free to drop questions in the chat. I mean, in <laughs> the comments section below. Um, and thank you so much for joining in and watching this video. If you liked it, please drop a like, maybe subscribe, hit the notification bell, all that fun stuff. And let me know if there are any other tutorials you would like to see in the future. Take care, y'all, and remember to stay sneaky sneaky. <laughs> Take care, y'all.